Hey what's up guys so in this video I'm going to show you how to play around and customize your task changer and it's very simple and easy to do and it will give you a lot of really cool options. So for that we will first go in the good lock app and here we will go in the makeup section and scroll down until you find home up. Now if you don't have the good lock app you can download it from the galaxy store and after that you will have to download and install the home up module here so once this is installed you can go in here and go in task changer in here just turn it on and then you can see that you have few options so you can go with the default one which is the list one so this is the default option but then you can play around with it and you can go with the grid option as well which gives you six uh, apps at the same time and then we have stack so this is also really sleek if you like this way then we have vertical options if you tap on it this will show you the vertical task changer and this is i think from the previous versions of android if you like that look you can go for that and then finally we have the slim list if you want things to be a little bit more clean you can go for this look personally i like to go with the grid look because this gives me six apps uh, in the task changer at the same time and then if you look below this you will find some more options so there is a mini mode here so if i tap on it this will minimize these apps so if i go in task changer now here you can see that they have been minimized to the lower half of the display so now i can use this with just one uh, hand and my thumb can reach all these six apps and i can uh, you know move around between these apps more easily you can also go in the mini mode with list or any of these to be honest so that's the list mode then you can go in stack now we have mini stack here so you get the idea whatever option you select you can turn on the mini mode for that option then we have app labels if you want the apps to be labeled or you can just remove it so now you don't see app names here you can also turn on or off the search bar so right now we have the search bar right here and you can search for apps in your task changer you can turn this off as well to make it more clean and then you can also turn off the recommended apps so these apps you see below you can turn them off so if i turn this off now you will see that now it has even more cleaner look and then below this we also have some gesture settings and these are for if you're not using the navigation buttons but you are using the gestures to navigate around your phone so you can switch to previous app with gestures tap on it and it will show you exactly how you can do this then we have allow bottom gestures in full screen mode so you can turn that on as well because sometimes if you're in full screen the gestures don't work but you can force your phone to do that then we have a gesture top priority setting uh, it says when there is interference in the gesture and the app area it will take advantage of the gesture priority so the gesture will always take priority if you turn this on and then we have home gesture vibration and bottom gesture sensitivity setting you can change the sensitivity of the gestures as well so there you go so this is how you can change the task changer on your phone customize it have some fun with it so that's about it from this video guys i hope you have enjoyed it i'll see you in the next one till then take care bye, -bye.